My name is Horacio Casillas. I'm the first artist in residence here at the Epic. I received my bachelor's degree in ceramics from Angelo State University, and I have my master's degree from the University of North Texas. I was born in Arizona, um, and soon after I moved to Mexico until the age of five. Um, right after that, we moved to San Angelo, where I spent most of my childhood, um, until I eventually went to Angelo State uh, for an art degree. When I first went into school, I really didn't know what I wanted to do. Um, I, I knew I liked art, but I just knew that I had to keep taking art classes um, until I landed in a ceramic class and um, the, the material is just so versatile that I, I fell in love with it knowing that I could make anything that I, that I thought of. The main thing I liked about clay was its potential for utility. Thinking about uh, somebody using something that I've made in their daily routine, um, just think about, thinking about like a a coffee mug and the relationship someone has with that mug, you know, it, it can be an intimate thing. Um, people put those those mugs on, you know, close to their lips. Just being able to offer a product to someone that can add value to their lives is one of the main reasons that I, that I got into this field. Um, the other main reason is, is my faith. Um, the way I see Anything that is made by the human, you know, the human hand is a reflection of God, our creator. So the way I look at it is God created us, therefore we create. I say it uh, just in our existence, we, we either consciously or subconsciously um, try to mimic or reflect God, our creator. The Epic has been my home for the past six months. Um, it's been an amazing experience. I, it's really given me the opportunity to just focus on my work um, like never before. I mean, most of my time is spent making. Um, I teach several classes, but the bulk of my, of my days is in the studio uh, just creating. Um, it really just gave, gave me that time that I didn't have either in grad school or in undergrad to think of uh, what I'm going to make. Um, so it's been, it's been an awesome way to, to just grow my, my thought inventory, I guess if you could say that. Um, I know where I want to go from here. I have some ideas of what I want to do. Um, and my work has evolved in some ways. So for that, I, I think it's, you know, I'm, I'm grateful for that. I think that's something that needs to happen within, within someone's art practice. Living here has facilitated a healthier routine. Um, it's, it's easier for me to just get out of bed, make my breakfast, you know, sit and read for a couple minutes, um, and then literally walk across the hall and, and get to work. I'm not rushing in traffic to get to work. I'm not um, having to worry about those things. I eventually want to be a college professor, um, but before that, I, I want to explore uh, more residencies. I, I want to I want to travel and I want to meet people, network, and and learn from other artists. Um, and I think the residency route is the way to go. So if I were to give any advice to to other artists that are considering you know doing this as a career um, or even just as recreation seek out residencies. There are so many out there um, and they're great opportunities. <laughs>